What drives me to volunteer is the smile on people's faces. A lot of the volunteer opportunities that I have a chance to be a part of um, involve people. So I get to watch people and I have the chance to see them progress and work towards their goals. And then when they achieve their goals, there's this big smile and there's this moment of excitement. What drives me to volunteer is that I believe it's my opportunity and everyone's opportunity to give back to the community in a way that allows them to make sure that they're part of the picture in helping that community thrive, grow, and move forward. My drive to volunteer stems from um, the leadership I grew up um, with and the mentors that showed me that volunteering doesn't have to look like the typical um, serving the lesser communities. It can look like helping your own community and pushing for everyone's success. Tonight we're going to be talking about a number of themes that impact young people in our community who volunteer and are involved in activism and advocacy. Our evening will involve a panel discussion with three uh, young people that are actively involved in volunteering and two experienced youth volunteer coordinators who are going to be sharing some insights from the organization perspective. And as we started, the first piece that was thrown up was that word cloud. Um, and in that word cloud, we saw a variety of different words such as energy, enthusiasm, passion, and so forth. What do you believe uh, youth volunteerism is? When I hear youth and volunteerism, the first word that comes to my mind is creativity. As youth seem to show you perspectives you never thought, and they bring very unique energy. Um, I think that a lot of times youth aren't taken seriously and especially breaking out into the volunteer field, um, it can be very scary to put yourself up there and out there with your ideas, your time, your effort and I just have a lot of admiration for everyone who does volunteer work no matter what capacity it's in, I think it's very brave. For me, it's kind of a big part of service, so kind of giving yourself over to something that you hold true and something that you honour um, and I always kind of keep that in mind when I'm volunteering. You know, youth are faced with a lot of sometimes stereotypes, a lot of barriers to, to volunteerism, um, and, and sometimes even self-made or even extrinsic. Um, and so, you know, what would be some of the pieces that you would sort of illuminate that, uh, that help you sort of break, break free from some of these stereotypes and, and be able to be brave? The things that I have volunteered for the longest and have grown the most in have been those experiences where I have started from the bottom. No matter what role you're taking on, it takes a village. Like no matter what the goal is, if it's activism, if it's a project, like no matter what you're volunteering with, no matter how small your role may seem or how small you perceive it, it is very valuable. Every single person is needed and valued. If we always keep hearing that youth are so idealistic or youth are so entitled or blah blah blah. Um, I would just put out there and suggest that maybe those are the things that you all that people think that about you lean into that because that's going to be what actually creates change because you're going to stand up and say no I am entitled I do deserve this hear my voice and so when you get confronted by folks that are like oh you're just young you're so idealistic you can rise to that and say yeah I am and this needs to change. Seeing youth take their stance, take their entitlement and say that we will have this future is so hopeful and so powerful to hear. One of the best pieces of advice that I can give is when someone presents an opportunity, take it. Don't look at it and say, I'm not capable. Don't look at it and say, um, this isn't my thing because you don't know until you try and it might not be your thing, but it might lead you to it. So having Youth is actually really important because they bring such a unique perspective and that is how you solve problems when you have a diverse opinion and perspective. Big round of applause for our panelists. Youth, you know, are just one big part of a large jigsaw puzzle. Um, you know, there isn't anything special or less special that any one group brings to the picture but it's the picture all together that makes it a thriving community. I think that youth bring their energy, I think they bring their drive, I think that they bring a different way of thinking than other people do. I think a narrative that's often fed to the youth is that our voices don't matter. And if I could change everything that ever made anyone think that, I would. 